Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Another update here on Solana. And uh, is the worst over for Solana or is there still more downside to come? We are gonna talk about that in this very interesting video. So make sure to watch towards the very end. Also like this video, subscribe to my channel. And if you guys are interested in daily trade signals, definitely go check out my trade alerts group in the first, first link in the description below this video. So let's dive straight here into the Solana content. We are here on the weekly time frame and check out my previous Solana update earlier today if you want more information about my higher time frame outlook on Solana. In this video, I'm gonna more I'm more gonna focus on the shorter time frames here. But first of all, I want to show you guys that uh, Solana at the moment on the weekly time frame is trading below the 0.5 Fibonacci level on the logarithmic time scale at $16.52. Uh, that will be our first major area of resistance above us if Solana is continuous continuing its way towards the upside if we drop lower from of this point if we lose support here on this order block here on the left side at from march 2021 then it is definitely possible that solana will enter uh, an area in between nine dollars and 83 cents all the way down towards uh, let's say seven dollars and 72 cents in this green zone and this will be the first uh, area of support below us and that's in line with the 0 0.618 the golden pocket fibonacci uh yeah retracement level so let's now zoom in here to the daily time frame and um yeah today has been a little boring day you can see the candle it's a little bit uh yeah yeah pretty neutral actually a wick on the on the top side and a wick on the bottom side so it could potentially be a reversal candle because these kind of candles usually occurs when a trend is gonna uh, flip to the other side so that is uh, on the other hand a good thing um, on the other hand if we look at the indicators uh, we can clearly see that on the daily time frame the daily rsi is forming a significant higher low here from off uh, the 9th of november 2022 and from off that point in time you can clearly see that the price is forming this lower low structure so yeah if we get a, a daily candle close in the green and especially tomorrow's candle then we will have a confirmed bullish rsi divergence here on the daily time frame and this can definitely lead to more upside for Solana in the shorter term. So yeah, the first major resistance above us is the 0 0.5 Fibonacci level. If we break above that retested as support, then I think Solana has a very high probability of as, at least testing areas uh, in between, let's say 26 US dollars and 31 US dollars for Solana. Let me mark out this as a target box for you guys. So let's say anywhere in this uh, in this zone i do expect solana to go if we uh, break above the 0 0.5 fibonacci level let me make this red by the way because it's an area of resistance so yeah let's see what uh, what will happen in the next few uh, days ahead of us it's um yeah looking pretty uh, exciting i mean uh, yeah not from a chart perspective but I mean, this, there's a lot happening in the crypto space, so I'm pretty excited about what we will see the next few weeks ahead of us. Um, yeah, so this is not looking good, of course, but the good thing is the bullish potential bullish RSI divergence, and we are very oversold. So I don't think, even if Solana is going to drop lower, I don't think it's going to go in a straight line. First of all, I expect some kind of a retracement back to the upside before potentially heading down lower. Um, let's also check out the four hourly time frame here. Solana is still trading within the oversold region here on several indicators. Um, on the four hourly time frame we are also forming this lower low structure on the price but a higher low on the rsi so we have a um yeah a confirmed bullish rsi divergence since the last few uh not the last three but the candle before that was very green so it is definitely possible to expect more upside in the shorter term for solana so that's my outlook in the shorter term today was pretty boring not a lot happening um, actually we are trading in no man's land so if you are interested in opening a potential long position on Solana I would definitely wait before Solana is above let's say um, 
when Solana is trading at $18.87, I do expect that it is very high likely that Solana will test the area in between 26 and uh, let's say 31 US dollars. So I would definitely wait before Solana is going towards this level or a potential retest of the 0 0.5 if we break above that before entering any long positions and make sure your stop loss is, is um, yeah, below this wick here. So let's say anywhere around $11.59. So I'll be back tomorrow. Hopefully uh, there will be happening more on the chart. And uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I see you guys tomorrow. Thank you. Bye-bye.